All right, we are on a tour of the Country Music Hall of Fame. This is exciting. What a great part. If you come down to Nashville, this has to be part of your stop. Tony is here with Kay from the museum, and, um, and uh, w this is wonderful. This is beautiful. What an experience this is. Look at this, the Taylor Swift Education Center. Oh, my gosh. Every, uh, every girl I know is just going to be like, Oh, I want to go, I want to go. <laughs> what spot should we hit first? Uh, well, we kind of like you to start on the third floor, and it, uh, the museum tells the story, history of country music in chronological order for the most part. Ah. We have a Kenny Rogers exhibit, though, that's up here, and then we have an Alan Jackson exhibit that's also up here on the third floor. And then you'll kind of go through the early 1800s and into the uh, 1990s, and then all the way into current country music down on the second floor. And what yep. tends to be the most popular exhibits? Like, what, what does everybody want to say? Where can you direct me to the, it's you know? It's different for everybody. It so is, huh? go crazy over the cars. We have Elvis Presley's limousine. We oh. have Webb Pierce's famous car that has uh, longhorns on the front and silver dollars in it. And um, we have the Smoking the Bandit 2 car. So oh. you get really excited about that. That's exciting. You know, some people like the new country, some people like the old country. So it really, there's something for everybody, but it's different for everybody, too. Well, we like a little bit of both. So I think we're going to have to see as much as possible. Yeah, it takes about two hours to properly go through it, you know, if you really take your time and look at everything. Um, but you can zip through an hour if you have to. 